Hello everyone, welcome to another craft time. My name is Ruth and today we're going to do this very cool Chinese lantern. This lantern is going to be easy. Uh, only you need this uh, construction paper, glue, right? Um, but I'm going to show you the materials for that. All right, let's start. So you need glue, okay? Uh, I prefer the stick, but you don't have to really, if you don't have the glue liquid, it can be the stick. Uh, we'll see in the process because we don't need that much, okay? Uh, step, step on, right? Uh, tape, if you have. And construction paper, any color or two or three colors, whatever color you want, okay? You also can do a lantern in white. You can color it first, you know, with anything that you like, and it look nice too. So I'm gonna show you after how we can do that, okay? Um, we're gonna put down my camera and we're gonna start with the cutting paper first, okay? Um, just hold on, I'm gonna hold my bucket here, okay? And we're gonna start for doing it, the cutting, okay? So I'll take you by construction paper. Okay? Uh, let's see, we're gonna choose, yeah, this is a nice color. All right, uh, you're gonna fold it into two, but not this way, you know, the this way, the rectangle way, okay? Fold it, make sure it's match the folder. Fold. There you go. And then we're gonna cut it in here, from here, okay? Not from this one, but this from the top. So get your scissors, right? And we're gonna start cutting. All right, now how, how much? Let's see, two or three fingers left the space on the bottom, okay? So we're gonna go straight, right? Done, done, done. Open and close, open your scissors and close, open and close it. If I just use the whole scissor, see, the big one, of course, when anyone you have really, it will work. And you just close, see, open and close, open and close, or, and that's it. I will this tiny one here. All right, how many? Uh, I don't know, let's count it. <laughs> one, two, three, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I got this thirteen. Now, now we're gonna, we have this, right? We're gonna fold it this way, okay? Now, then we're gonna glue it, or we're gonna staple, or we're gonna tape it. Either way, it's gonna work, okay? Uh, in this case, I'm gonna tape. Tape, and from the top to the other side. And also I'll staple. Okay. Now you can just staple. Right? Uh oh, staple is not gonna work. <laughs> and then we can put it some tape on the top. Tape on the top. There you go. Now the next step to do is get your top. You can choose any color, maybe orange, right? For the top. Okay, let's do this orange color. Mm -hmm. Cut um, maybe like this. That was mm, just to, on the side of the construction paper, and you just need this much. Don't need it that much really to put on the top. Okay. Now for around the lantern, you know, we need another round. So we're gonna get maybe like this, right? And now if you wanted to do a design on the top of here, go ahead. Um, how about wiggle it, wiggle it, wiggle it, wiggle it, wiggle it, right? Up and down, up and down. Zigzag, I would call zigzag. You can do a zigzag. Or whatever it looks like, it's gonna be so pretty, okay? And then glue, put so, lots of glue along the stripe. Down, down, down. Down from here to here, from here to here. <laughs> All right, I use the stick one. Now again to the lantern on the bottom and just start gluing. Go around, go around, right? And glue it. Now, there's two ways to do it, but I'm gonna show you with the other one, okay? If it needs more glue, go ahead, put more glue. And guys, we have the bottom, now we need to do the top. The top we already cut in, remember? This one, yeah, I'm gonna tape it. I'm gonna put it one inside, okay? Inside. From inside, we're gonna tape it because it will look better. 
or you can do in this in the oxide too up to you okay okay let's do the oxide so i think i like it too yes i like it and i put it one inside just in case for more security <laughs> once it just secure the the craft okay it doesn't get broken or something like that. okay now you can do this inside or outside okay put a tape right but you still left a little bit more here so we're gonna take we're gonna tape inside okay or you can glue right just use the glue what will work that is so cute i love it <laughs> look at how steady it is see nice so this is one way there's another way to do it if you want to do some decorations on the on the top you can do that too we can just uh, cut in with are those staples those is nice okay it just if it's a heart it will come up as a heart you want to see show you okay one, maybe do two or three parts, right? There you go. <laughs> that cool? Or you can cut your own heart, right? How you cut your own heart? Get a square like me, fold it. It's always nice to fold it. And we're gonna do a heart shape in here. Okay. Now you can do this way. Put so this way it's a it's a way to do it but i can show you you just have to draw a little half a heart on the paper and then cut it okay now this is another way the other way to do a heart let me show you right and by drawing a heart actually get a pen so and draw a heart like me right and cut it okay that's the other way too um, you always need to draw it because you don't really know when how to use it, the seeds or things like that. This helps. There you go. Okay, so now we're gonna glue the hearts, right? Up. Oh, you guys go like this, I know. <laughs> you say yes, and then go another heart and put it here as a decoration. How oh, cool, cool is this, guys? Huh? And you can put as much decoration as you want, and you land it there nice <laughs> okay so let's do the other way that i'm going to show you quickly um it's with the white paper okay what you have to do is do a design so you can do markers right and do whatever you want maybe you want to do an ocean and maybe you just uh, want to do some graphics like me right and get a different color maybe a, a red one and go thumb, 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 thumb. how cool is this look now maybe um what else I, what else i have here oh i see i only have red and uh, add yellow <laughs> okay and go like this okay so once you have your pattern already ready i mean like this okay you're gonna cut it same thing fold it right fold it get a scissors cut it remember three fingers in the bottom left there or whatever you scissors allow to you to do it okay Cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it, open and close. All right. Once you have this one, open it, right? And tape it. I'm gonna tape this time because it's, that's what I lost for me. <laughs> tape, tape, oh, I'm gonna show you the other way right here. There's also a decoration that you can do in this page if you want to. Now get a yellow paper here. One side, also paper. <laughs> I know, eh? Yeah. And get the glue and put it on the bottom. This is another way to do it too, okay? So when it's stay, tape it and tape it. And how cool is this, guys? Uh -huh. How cool is this? Look at with your own design too. So either way, it will work. Um, like this or like that all right and of course we're gonna we have to do the top too okay uh so i'll show you this so the three different ways to do a lantern and have fun all right thanks for watching guys i hope you enjoyed this craft and i will see you in the next one bye bye